Welcome back to another YouTube video. I am feeling like my usual self again. Honestly, the past few weeks I haven't quite felt 100, but I feel happier. I feel more on track with my nutrition, my training's going well, and I just feel like this week is gonna be a good week, and today is a good day to have a good day. So, let's get started on this YouTube video. It's going to be a protein smoothie one. They're all going to be vegan based recipes, but of course you could use a whey protein if you want. I am just so aware of how many of you are plant based or how many of you are lactose intolerant. So I wanted to try a few vegan proteins. I'll give you three vegan protein smoothie recipes. And then at the end, I might even rate them and tell you which one I thought was the best. But I did also want to say that I have never really tried many vegan protein powders. I just personally would use a whey one, but after filming the recipes that I did for this video, I absolutely love them and I would happily have any of them throughout the week. So I hope that you enjoy this video and if you want more like this, make sure you give it a thumbs up and drop in the comments below. I just got the ghost vegan protein and pancake batter flavor. I always get asked about the ghost vegan brand, so I haven't actually tried this. I love all the away based ones, but I thought I would give it a go today. One thing I absolutely love about ghost is that you always get the scooper on top. I'm using 200 mils of almond coconut unsweetened, but of course you could use any kind of dairy free milk that you like. I have some vanilla almond milk ice cubes. You could use water or you could use some pre-prepared almond milk ice cubes. So 100 grams of ice cubes, 30 grams of ghost protein powder. To make it nice and creamy, we are going to add 40 grams of frozen banana. Shake it all about, and then we just want to blend it up. Okay, moment of truth, my first time trying the Ghost Vegan Protein, and it is banana batter pancake flavor, so we'll see. Oh my gosh, it's so creamy. Wow. I'm not gonna lie, I rate the smoothie recipe. It's the first time I've ever made it. First time trying that protein powder. Ding! <laughs> it gets the tick of approval from Aunt Julie. Yay! I'm really happy with that. I definitely recommend that recipe and this protein powder. So again, I've only tried it in this protein smoothie like my first time ever tasting it but the most important thing i think when it comes to the differences between vegan and whey based protein powders for recipes or whether you want to mix them with water is the kind of grittiness and the thickness of them all vegan protein powders that i have tried have been really gritty and grainy when just mixed with water i honestly can't even stomach um vegan protein powders with water but when you mix them in smoothies they can be really delicious so I hope that you try uh, this recipe and my coffee one and then I'll show you what the next recipe is as well I honestly am loving doing these recipe kind of videos so if you do want more of them make sure you drop a comment and let me know what you want to see next I'm so happy to do like smoothie recipes or breakfast ideas whatever you want I'm here to create 110 grams of chocolate almond milk ice cubes, 200 mils of unsweetened coconut and almond milk, one scoop of salted caramel blessed protein, a sachet of instant coffee. You could use a hot chocolate drinking mix if you wanted, but I'm using a collagen mocha based one. This one is so good, I forgot to actually film me trying it, but anyway, I have this quite often leading up to summer, especially in the morning as like my mid-morning pick-me-up kind of coffee. It is delicious, it tastes sweet, and I don't know, I just really like it, so yeah, cheers. So 200 mils of ice cold water, I've added in some vanilla almond ice cubes, and I'm also going to add in a dash of vanilla almond milk. Feel free to add in any other kind of additions to it. I'm gonna add some cinnamon in. 30 grams of vanilla chai, and the scooper is nowhere to be found, so I'm just going to use a tablespoon. 
And lastly, 100 grams of frozen strawberries. Oh my gosh, the blender is going to have to work pretty hard on this one. Um, this is honestly the perfect smoothie for a summer's day like today. Okay, before I race through all of this and finish it, I just want to give you kind of a summary of the protein powders and what I thought and what my favorite ones were in order. So this one is definitely delicious, but it's not my favorite. My favorite one would definitely be the coffee kind of salted caramel one. I've been having that almost every day recently. Then it would be the pancake batter one and then this would be my third one. So the vanilla chai would be third. But I do find that the blessed protein powders are quite kind of chalky, which is common for vegan protein powders. I've never actually tried a vegan one with just water. I honestly don't think I could stomach it. But in smoothies, I find them really delicious. So if you're someone that is sensitive to whey or you can't really have much dairy, then of course using a vegan protein would be a great idea for you especially in your smoothies but if I personally had to choose what protein powder I would use I would definitely go for a whey based one and then if it was a vegan one I'd only use it in smoothies maybe I should try more vegan ones let me know what your favorite vegan protein powders are in the comments I always get asked what my favorite ones are that's why I wanted to try some more I'm definitely keen to try the ghost one and like oats and other recipes and things like that too because I've literally only tried it once and it was for this video so I definitely need to try it in a few other recipes and maybe in my oats and things like that to give you a better idea of what I think of it but otherwise if you enjoyed this video and you want more recipes you want me to try some other products you want me to try different recipes or I don't know whatever you want to see on this channel let me know in the comments I'm here to create content that helps you either stay entertained on your journey or just to help you get through your fitness journey you are never alone when you are following my social media channels because I'm always here to help you so if you did enjoy this video please make sure you give it a thumbs up drop a comment below and I'll catch you in the next video